Hello, in this video I would like to show you a better way to accept Bitcoin donations than just leaving out your address on your website. In case you do not know, address reuse is very bad for your privacy. That's why it's recommended that for each payment users should use a different address. However, for many users who simply want to accept donations in a private way, this is not possible because they would need to generate a different address for each payment. One of the solutions you can use is a payment button created by BTC Pay Server. BTC Pay Server is free and open source Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies payment processor which will allow you to accept donations completely free directly to your software or hardware wallet without any cost. BTC Pay can be self-hosted or you can use a third-party host. Difference is simple. The third-party host solutions are hosted by other people and the self-hosted server is the server which you are hosting. I will leave a link in the description of this video where you can read more about BTC Pay server, how you can launch one or how you can find a free host and use their server to accept donations. If you are very serious about your privacy and want to explore more features which self-hosted solution brings you, I recommend that at one point you definitely launch a self-hosted server. However, for now, let's just assume that either you self-hosted your server or you're using a third party. You will see this page here and the first thing you need to do is create a store. You need to go to stores and create a new store. Click on the create a new store button. And let's say that we want our store to be called payment button. Once you create a store, you'll see a bunch of options here which you can create. BTC Pay will simply generate a new invoice each time someone clicks on your payment button. You can specify here the expiration time for your invoice or the amount of confirmations after which you want to consider your invoice paid. You can also accept payments in different cryptocurrencies and also Lightning Network. However, please note that Lightning Network is only possible if you have your own self-hosted BTC Pay server for now. First thing you need to do is add derivation scheme to your wallet. This is a public key of your wallet. Whoever has access to this key cannot access your funds, but they can see all the addresses that your wallet has. You're not uploading your private key on BTC Pay server, you're simply uploading the public key. If, if in any way public key is compromised, your funds are always safe. BTC Pay server never asks for your private key. Let's now go to BTC, click modify, paste your address here and just click continue. I have a whole other video which will explain you how you can compare this address to address in your wallet. You can also use your hardware wallet like uh, Trezor or Ledger Nano S. Actually, some of these are already implemented out of the box. But for now, let's assume you just pasted the XPUB key out of your software wallet. And you also checked that they are correct. So this address is the same one that which your wallet is showing. If so, click confirm. So now we added our wallet. This now means that BTC Pay server will be able to generate invoice for your wallet when someone clicks on payment pay button. That said, let's go to pay button. Click on pay button here. And you need to allow anyone to create invoices. And now this is where you can customize the options inside button. Uh, depending on the time when you're watching this video, the user interface and experience may change. But for now, I will just stick with the default options. You can change the price, the currency here. You can add the description. You can even add order ID and of course change the image of the button itself. You can also here customize the size. You'll see at the bottom of the screen that the size of this button will change. If you do not like this one, you can very easily put the link to your image which you like here. You can also enter email where you want notifications to be sent and also specify redirect. So for instance, let's say that you want to thank to anyone who donated to you, you can you can create a thank you page and then put it here. So when, when they donate to your button and pay the invoice, they will be redirected to thank you page where you can thank them for donating. Click on the copy code green button at the bottom 
and now we need to paste this form inside the any HTML website. In this example, I'll be using a very commonly used CMS or content management system called WordPress. I already have a website set up here. Let's say that you have an article inside WordPress and you want to insert a donation button here. You would, of course, need to go into your WordPress article or any. So just to be clear, you can paste this code into any HTML page. It does not have to be WordPress. I'm just using it here because it's uh, very easy. Uh, specifically for WordPress, you always need to go not in visual but in text mode. Paste your form here and click update. Let's now preview the changes. As you can see now, we have a pay with BTC pay here button. And when someone clicks on that button from your visitors, they will be redirected to the invoice. Where they can leave their address, you can also disable this uh, refund email. I will just use test at test.com. Here, whoever wants to donate to you can pay to your wallet directly without you ever having to reuse another address, which significantly improves the overall privacy. Let's now go back and let's say that uh, I just want to show you how this button can be customized and put on different places. Let's say that you want to put it into the widget on your WordPress site. In your WordPress, go to Appearance Widgets, then select Custom HTML and put it into sidebar. Don't forget to paste the form of your button and you can put some text here. Click save and now let's go to our post which I earlier created to see where the button will appear. You will now see that the button will appear here in the sidebar and in my opinion this is a very nice place for uh, having a donation button but you can also place it here for instance you can see at the footer of your website or whatever you wish. So no matter which uh, platform you use, this button can be placed into any HTML. And of course, when someone clicks on the button, they will be taken to this invoice page where they can pay and donate to you. There are also many ways in which you can use BTC Pay to accept donations, but I will cover some of those in the next video. For now, just remember that you can very easily accept payments without any intermediate or a third party by using BTC Pay server and uh, receiving those donations directly to your wallet. There will be no processing fees, there, will, there won't be any subscriptions. BTC Pay is completely uh, free open source software made by community and uh, you can either self-host it or use some of the third party servers. If you are not ready to self-host it yet at this point, you just want to test, test this uh, pay button, I will leave a link uh, to all of the resources where you can learn more about BTC Pay. That's it for now. Thank you very much for watching and if you have any questions, I will leave a link to our Slack group where you can come and ask any sort of questions and we will help you out. Bye bye.